All right, guys, I'm the Delta Vader. In the next couple of minutes, I'm going to show you how I got funded 900K with my simple three-step strategy and my custom trading view indicator. All right, guys, so as I mentioned, the strategy is super easy. It's just three simple steps. First step is finding a liquidity sweep. Second step is finding your entry by an inverse fair value gap. And the third step is finding a take profit point. Uh, now, this isn't my strategy. I think the OG for this strategy is uh, Dodgy's DD. So shout out to him. Uh, he, he's created the liquidity sweep into the inverse fair value gap. And what I've done here is I've created a custom trading view indicator, which essentially marks out liquidity points and finds the inverse fair value gap and then marks out uh, more liquidity points that will be your take profit. Uh, so let's go ahead and jump in. Cool. So as I mentioned, the first step of the strategy is finding liquidity sweep. Now, liquidity sweep is finding an area where other traders may have set their stops, so maybe a high or a low, and then running that stop loss area, finding liquidity, and then finding a reversal in the market. So three good areas for liquidity that we can find every day are high time frame liquidity levels, previous session highs and lows, and daily highs and lows. So if we go to the indicator, we can press the settings and we can activate the show high time frame liquidity levels. Now, what this will do will show you the possible liquidity levels on higher time frames. The default setting is 15 minutes, as you can see here, uh, but you can set it to any time frame you like, one hour, four hour, anything you prefer. The next uh, liquidity level is the previous session highs and lows. So as you can see here, we've marked out the session and then we have the high and the low. And the, the default setting for this in the indicator is the Asian session into the London session, but you can put any parameters you like for any different session and it will mark the highs and lows for you. The next setting is to show the daily highs and low levels. So as you can see here, the indicator has painted the high of the day and the low of the day on the chart. Uh, when this gets mitigated, it will then move down to the next high and low of the day. Cool, so now we have all three of our liquidity sweep conditions marked on the chart for us. Uh, we're at 9.30 on Monday, the 4th of November on NQ. Uh, so this is the start of the US uh, NYSE, uh, NYSE open. And basically what we're trying to do is wait for price to sweep the liquidity levels. As you can see here, we've already swept the Asian low. And so obviously what we're looking for is the more liquidity to be swept, the better. And then we'll be looking for our entry. So let's see what price does. As you can see here, we dive down and we sweep the 15 minute um, higher time frame liquidity levels, the daily low, and the Asian low. So we've swept quite a bit of liquidity. So what we could expect now is a possible reversal, which brings us on to our next step in the strategy, the confirmation. Now, this isn't always necessary, but it does bring extra confidence to a trade and also extra accuracy in the trades that do bring confirmation. So our first um, section of confirmation is if price is outside the um, uh, volume average high or the volume average low. So we can activate on the chart, And you see, we get this red line and this green line here. The green line is the volume average low, and the red is the volume average high. Now you can see that we are well below the volume average low. So what this means is volume is not backing this move, and the majority of the volume is still staying within this area. And, and so what we could expect is for price to move back into the volume average or this area here. And um, so, yeah, cut this bit out. And for our second confirmation, we can look for the higher time frame fair value gaps. So what we can do is activate that on the chart and we'll be able to see fair value gaps from higher time frames. So we might see um, a possible support or resistance area. Great, so we have a five minute um, fair value gap here on the chart, as you can see. So price is pushed into this fair value gap and also another confirmation for a possible reversal. Okay, great. So now that we have our liquidity sweep followed by our confirmations, we're now looking for an entry on the chart by an inverted fair value gap. Now, an inverted fair value gap is quite simple. Um, it's just a fair value gap that is closed in one direction, and then the price has come back and closed above it in the opposite direction. So we can get the indicator to show us our inverted fair value gap on the chart. Uh, we simply exit out of the uh, liquidity sweeps and the confirmation, and we can get it to show us inverted fair value gaps and fair value gaps. Great, so we can see on the chart, we do have some bearish fair value gaps being painted. So what we would be looking for is for price to close above these fair value gaps and invert them, and therefore creating an inverted fair value gap. So we can see here, we are almost close above it. And then the next candle, we close above it. And we can see the indicator will paint a 
yellow square where there's an inverted fair value gap and also a green where there is a bullish fair value gap. And we can see we do have another bearish fair value gap here. So for extra confirmation, you might want to wait for price to close above this. Depends on your strategy, you might not. And you can see we do get the close almost above it. We get the confirmation from the indicator of the inverted fair value gap and we do have um, another bullish fair value gap there. So I would say this is a great entry, nice and clean. So we enter the, we'll enter the entry and we will put our stops at the nearest swing low. Great, so now that we have our entry, all we need to do is find our take profit point. Now, how we do that is by finding local liquidity levels, equal highs and lows, or the point of control. So we can go over to our indicator settings, we go to the take profit section, and we can activate all three, and the indicator will paint them on the chart for us. Perfect, so you can see here we have three different types of lines. We've got these green lines here, which are equal highs, and uh, or if it was below the chart, they'd be red and be equal lows. We have these blue lines here, which are local liquidity. So you can, as you can see, they're painted at local liquidity where people's stop losses might be uh, placed. And we also have this big white line in the middle, which is the point of control. So that is the where the most volume is being traded for this session. So always around these um, areas, we can use them to find good um, take profit points. So for this one, we're going to put our take profit point at the nearest equal high. Equal highs have a very, very, very high accuracy. Um, for take profit points and also for liquidity sweeps and um, they get taken out all the time um, and they're highly used by um, professional traders like dodgy dg uh, he has it in his strategy as well um so yeah we'll let this run and we'll see how it goes right, so as we can see we get the equal high swept and our take profit hit all right guys so that's pretty much it that's the whole strategy as i said it's just a simple three-step strategy liquidity sweep with the confirmation uh, find an entry by fair, inverse fair value gap, and then we just set our take profit point at local liquidity. Very, very simple. Uh, makes it even easier with the indicator. You don't have to mark anything on the chart. It does it all automatically for you. Um, I do offer a free three-day trial for the indicator, so you can check it out, um, You know, see if it's for you. If it's not completely cool, um, I do have a Discord as well. I'm live trading in there every day using the indicator. Um, you know, I post free signals and loads of free educational content as well. Um, so jump in. Uh, the links and the... Uh, Free trial are available at deltabeta.com. Um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, hope you find the strategy profitable. Um, I know it's been very profitable for me. And yeah, happy trading. Peace.